despairrepair.com. Hi everyone and welcome to despairrepair.com. In this video we're going to show you how to check the alternator voltage output on your car. Uh, checking the voltage output is same on every car so although we're doing this video on a Skoda Fabia Mark 1 uh, the basic principle applies to all cars. Uh, for a short introduction we're inside uh, inside the engine bay. This here is the alternator. Okay, its main purpose is to is to supply the car with electricity and recharge the battery during uh, during uh, driving. Uh, when the alternator is not doing its job uh, properly, you'll get symptoms like uh, dim lights. Uh, you won't be able to start because it doesn't recharge the battery, or even have small kinds of uh, electronic problems. The first thing uh, you'll need is a multimeter like this one. There are two types, essentially there is the analog one, uh, the old type, and the digital one like uh, this one which most people use. The first thing you have to do is set, I'll just go to the camera, make the setting on 20 volts direct current. Uh, the uh, voltage installation on the car is 12 volts, so 20 volts will do. Now you have to get access to the car battery. In this case, it's under a plastic lid on most cars. It's that way, it will be in, in some sort of plastic casing or whatever. In this case, it has a plastic lid. And first of all, you open the lid to gain access to the car battery. Now, after you open the lid, take the instrument, put it in a safe place on in this case, we've put it on the uh, plastic engine covering and do the next. Uh, the, red, the red tester goes on the plus battery pole and the black one goes on the minus battery pole. Uh, don't mix them up or you won't get a good reading. Uh, just in case, the battery cable of the plus is always red and the minus cable is always black. So red on red, black on black. Once we've connected the testers to the uh, battery poles, uh, the multimeter shows the reading from the battery itself. As you can see, before the car is started, it's 12.18 volts. Um, that's the standard voltage for the battery when the car is not, is not started. Now we will start the car. Or connect to be more clear, once you've connected the uh, multimeter to the battery, start the car. Now after we've started the car, we've got the voltage output reading, which is 14 volts, 14.25, 26, 27 volts, which is great. That is the standard, which tells us that the uh, alternator is doing its job properly. Anything under this voltage, below 13.5 volts is bad, okay? Then you should go and make a uh, check. After you check that the voltage is okay or not okay, uh, you remove the testers from the battery poles and put the battery lid back into place. Be sure it's closed uh, properly. So as you can see, this is a very simple test you can do on your own uh, if, you have a, if you have a multimeter. So this is the first checking point in order to see if anything, if there is any other malfunction on the car regarding uh, the uh, recharging system. Uh, some advice, uh, the charging voltage should be uh, between 13.5 uh, volts minimum to 14.25, uh, 14 20, 25 volts maximum, okay? Anything under that. And you'll have problems with the battery recharging, you'll have dim lights, you'll have problems starting the car or whatever. Anything above that, so anything above 14.25 volts, uh, may cause a damage to the alternator or damage to the battery. We hope this video was helpful. If you liked it, please click the subscribe button. For more information on how to do checkups and simple repairs around the car, be sure to visit us at despairrepair.com.